Hello, today I'm reading Hoot. It's another book in the Talk to the Animals series, and this one's all about making um, nighttime animals' noises. Here's the title page and the end papers. When I finish the story, I'll make some of those noises for you. It starts off saying, I see a line of fruit bats hanging in a tree. What do you say, little fruit bats? Yeah, they are all lined up. They can be pretty noisy when there's lots of them. I see a furry possum nearly falling off. What do you say, furry possum? Cough, cough, cough. That's a ringtail possum. You can see his curly little tail. I see a slinky fox sneaking through the park. What do you say, slinky fox? Bark, bark, bark. I see a staring owl against the inky blue. What do you say, staring owl? Hoot, hoot, hoo. There's an owl who lives near us and he, I think he's a tawny frogmouth, and he goes, om, om. I see a spotty frog resting on a leaf. What do you say, spotty frog? Ribip, ribip, ribip. I see a sugar glider zooming through the sky. What do you say, sugar glider? Cry, cry, cry. They're such beautiful little animals. Then the owl says, goodbye. So who can we see there? We can see an owl going hoo hoo, a mouse going a bat going a fox going bark bark, a lizard going, oh no, that's a gecko going yip yip, a, a coughing possum, a beeping frog, a thumping rabbit, a purring cat, and a growling, a growling possum and a whooshing wombat. There's lots of the animals that you can hear in the night or where I live anyway. Anyway, that's the end of Hoot. Thanks for listening. Good night.